Inspired by the ability of sagebrush to create snowdrifts, snow snakes are one of YDOT's newest tools to help control blowing snow. They're used between snow fences and the highway and in areas where construction has left no vegetation along the road. We have it in four locations. There's some on top of the summit along I-80. There's some on the west side of Laramie along I-80. And then the other two sites are closer to Rock Springs and Green River. Because they're made of wire frames and plastic netting, snow snakes can be placed closer to highways and in medians without posing a safety hazard. When we're inside the, the clear zone or close to the clear zone, we don't want to put up a structural snow fence that could be hit or damage the car or the person uh, when it's hit. So, and we don't want to also build a lot of drift onto our roadway. Highways where surrounding vegetation is gone due to construction are prone to icing. Snow snakes help reduce icing and provide water and protection to speed the return of vegetation. And this will help us get a jump start on protecting our grassland and erosions as well as giving us a start on our uh, snow fence locations. Research is continuing into the snake's design and where they can be most effective. It's easy for the maintenance foreman to actually install this themselves and they can put it up relatively quickly in a trouble spot and see if that helps and if they need more snow fence then we can start to put the structural stuff outside. Remember if there's ice and snow take it slow and always buckle up. This is Doug McGee reporting.